Hi everybody, welcome to my channel, Rosie Cooks. I'm making a chocolate cake, but what's different about it is you're gonna need a devil's food cake mix and a brownie mix. We're going to use four eggs, two melted sticks of butter, one and a quarter cups of water. Then we're gonna make a chocolate ganache for the topping. It's gonna to be delish. Let's do this. So right here I'm adding my brownie mix. And here's my cake mix. Here's my water. Here's my butter. And here's my eggs. Now I'm gonna mix this together. And here's my bunt pan. It's sprayed with a baking spray. That's why it's white. It has flour in it. I'm gonna add my cake batter to my bunt pan. So here's my cake mix. It's ready for the oven. I have a 350 degree oven waiting. We're gonna pop this in anywhere from 40 to 50 minutes until you can put a toothpick in it and it comes out clean. So here's my cake. It's been 45 minutes. And you know it's completely cooked when you insert a toothpick and it comes out clean. So now I'm gonna wait 10 minutes and then I'm going to flip it onto a plate. Here's my cake. It's gorgeous, look at that. There's something about a chocolate cake. So I'm gonna make a chocolate ganache but we're gonna wait till this completely cools off. So let's make our chocolate ganache. Starting off with some heavy whipping cream. I'm gonna warm this up until it's just under the boiling point. Okay, see these little bubbles? That's when it's warm enough. Right here, I have my chips. And I'm gonna add my heavy whipping cream. So I'm just gonna let it sit for about three minutes and it's gonna soften up all those chips. Okay, it's been three minutes and now I'm going to mix this together, mix it up. And it gets really smooth like this. Perfect. Okay, now let's put it on our cake. So now I'm just gonna pour it on top of my cake. Right down the middle. So that it goes all around the edges. And pours down the sides. I think this is the perfect amount because other recipes will have a lot of the chocolate sauce, the ganache. I don't know. I don't like that much, that much sweet. It has a beautiful look. There's just enough. I don't know. I've noticed other recipes where they really have a lot of this chocolate ganache on it. And I think this is the perfect amount. Okay, so now let's cut into it. Okay, so we're gonna cut a piece. My goodness, it is a little thicker. Just by cutting it, I can tell. Hmm, interesting. Okay, let's get our cake. My goodness, look at this. Oh, look at this, of course. A big hole in the middle of my cake. How the heck does that happen? <laughs> Whatever, it's gonna taste the same way with the hoe or without the hoe. I gotta taste this. Mm hmm. It's good. It's um a little thicker than like a basic box cake mix because it has the brownie mix in it. So if you're gonna say kind of like a pound cake, kind of. Hmm. Very interesting, very good. Okay. So this is 
the cake mix with the brownie mix together. Very easy, a little different, a little, um, I don't know, it's just a little, it's kind of like a pound cake consistency, if you're going to say, if I'm going to describe it. It's very good. Okay, thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe, give me a thumbs up, and I'll see you next time.